Hey, everybody. I listened. Wait, I've said this the last 40 scopes I've done. That, um... Everyone's like, you should scope more. Hey, when are you going to get back on Periscope? Well, here I am. I have wine teeth right now. Sorry about that. Yeah, it was too much for whoever that was. Uncle Google. Yo. Okay. How much will you pay for them? Honestly, if I could, like, that would be awesome if I could get some money out of my butt hair right now. Because I'm, I'm low on cash, man, and honestly, I don't need that. $35? See, that's just enough to be like, hmm. Hmm. Can you, uh, do you have PayPal? <laughs> I don't think selling my butt hairs on the internet is how I want to... It's not how I want to be remembered. Not yet. I might get to that point. <sighs> how would I explain that to anyone? You know? Hey man. When are you coming out of the bathroom? Give me just a second. I'm meticulously shaving off my ass hair and saving it so I can sell it on the internet. I like to eat the gum you find at a pub uh, public benches. Well, you probably have a really good... Uh, well, actually, that's an interesting question for someone who knows more about bacteria because I was going to say you probably have a better immune system because of that, but it really depends on how long the gum has been there because if it's been there for any length of time, I don't think bacteria would really live... I don't think, like, gum doesn't really, like, rot. It kind of just solidifies. So, that would be uh, an interesting question f for someone who knows more about medicine than me. Like, how, how much risk am I putting myself in by eating fucking gum off the ground and off benches all the time? I've never understood why people stick it under benches. They're addicted to spice and trolling people. Hey man, if you're young, I using the word trolling, ooh, you know? I don't know, you can do better than that, but if you're young, definitely we all go through that edgy stage where we need to go and troll people, right? Alright, I mean you might be you might be a little old then. Um, but hey, I'm not gonna judge. I'm not gonna tell you how to live. Uh, I definitely, definitely went through an edgy stage, for sure. Where I would, like, you know, dress really provocatively, and then run around yelling at people in public. But I guess that, you know, if you actually care about honor, which is really silly, I guess that's a little bit more honorable than internet trolling. I don't really care, though. Because then you have to face physical consequences in the immediate... Um, but I've, you know, actually I've never really been anonymous on the internet, so I wasn't an emo, no. I was the opposite of an emo, man. I always endeavored to, I mean, I always did, did drugs that prevented me from feeling anything. And not in a, um, so I can't handle this way, but just like in a, hey, I want to, day-to-day life, I want to be totally apathetic. Um, I also, like, what's wrong with emo? Nothing, nothing's wrong with emo. I just, that, that was, the question was, were, was I emo? And I was not. Um, I went to Warp Tour <laughs> with some friends in eighth grade because I had no idea what it was. I, I saw the All-American Rejects live. 
Um, worst experience of my life. It's fucking horrible, man. Uh, everybody started crowd surfing to the point where the ratio of people on the ground and in the air was really precarious. So, like, I ended up, like, single-handedly carrying, like, two girls to the front. I have no idea what that is. I'm sorry. I can't really do white music anymore. I couldn't ever, but definitely can't now. Well, I mean, I guess actual white music, which is the only, the only white music really is classical music. Um, everything else is black music, so, technically. Uh, but yeah, emo. Definitely. Do I write books? Um, I have a book, yeah. Bollywood. Now that's the stage I want to go through. Um, what are you writing right now? I published a poetry collection this spring. So, that was interesting. It's significantly discounted right now. If you want to buy it, you can literally get it for $8, which is as low as I can possibly put it, um, and still break even, basically. But that involves making a CreateSpace account if you want to just uh, buy it from Amazon. It's $12.99 right now. I really wish Amazon did coupon codes. That'd be great. Yeah. Do you have something to say about that? Hello. Hello. Excuse me, sorry. Anyway, none of my regular audience is here, so none of you care. How old am I? I'm 22. Um, but I finally got um, a. I finally got a recording done, edited, uploaded on Bandcamp of an improv that I snuck into the school to do, which is all I accomplished today. So, I think I'm going to go for this. That looks pretty cool. I definitely, um, young Barbara Bush, that's what I'm going for. I look like your brother? Cool. It's really weird. it's really rare that I find doppelgangers. So how how much do I look like your brother? Oh, I can't believe I'm asking that.
How's it going, man? What's up? Yeah, I didn't order a pizza, but I think my niece did. Yep. Give me just a second. I'll be right back. <laughs>